to you, my friend. Part of Chaz Mac Gaming. We've got ourselves the Valkyries. The 15 Valks it is. With that queen to the bottom side. Gonna try to charge this queen. Ooh, that's a lot of damage. That king's... Oh, he... Okay, I was gonna say. He re... Okay, so he recalls the queen so that he could send the dragon rider into the eagle artillery, but it's not going there as a Tesla pops. Uh-oh. Wait a second. A Tesla pops sends a blimp into the town hall. We've got sneakies. There's the invis rage, but they go to the other storage. Oh, he's got bowlers. Oh, he's not sneaky. But the Dragon Rider did not grab that eagle. Another invis. He wants to get the bowler browns onto the in the monolith. He's getting the skip. Look at that. The super bowler getting the skip. Freezing because he ran out. Oh, yes. The final skip of the super bowler takes the monolith down. G G. Oh, my. But that queen is so low. The expo is going to force queen ability. Ouch. Oh, no. Rip queen ability. But the king is going to go into the scatter with the Valks. The warden moving his way in. Gonna have, but the problem is that eagle artillery is still standing. He wanted that to go down from the dragon rider. Where's the rest of the Valks? He hasn't deployed them all just yet. The king ability. Removing the enemy queen. Pops the warden eternal tome. No more rages. As there's the Valks by themselves to the left side. Sends the RC into the eagle. Poison onto the skellies over there. Does stun the eagle artillery. That queen needs to stay up as she's continuing her charge through. The Valkyries have almost basically disappeared. Look at that. He used one super miner to go sneak in to help try to remove that multi-target inferno. The king comes back alive as the RC is trying to run around. Oh, the super miner. Oh, it didn't know what it was going to do. And the queen's getting stuck. She's not going for the multi Queen is ignoring the multi because of the CC that ended up coming out after her. And the Valkyries all have disappeared on the left side. That Electro Titan doing work right there. Oh man, great effort there. It has a few more Valks to send around. Has the Arch. Has some Wizards. Try to get every little bit of percentage. You never know what that's going to do. But wizards clearing this. Ground Expo. Oh, just out of range. The Electro Titan, once it gets to the Archer, bye-bye. Down goes the Archer, and it's going to be about 77%. I see the plan. Great effort there. Falling just a bit short. What does she have planned with the Super Minions? 10 Super Minions with a Queen Charge. All right, it's a super minion attack. You don't see this off too often as we're seeing a wall break for the queen to try to charge in towards this town hall. Does have a recall to pull this queen back. Will the queen go to the right side? Should. There's the rage. Oh, there's some lightning onto a sweeper. That was potentially... Okay, it was probably pointing over to the right side over here because that's probably where she wants to send the super minions in. And then reroute the queen back to the eagle artillery, maybe, with that king up there. As the town hall is going down. Lost the unicorn, but that's okay. Town hall. Recall. There's the recall. Pulling that queen back. Okay, sending that queen over here. So, gonna have to somehow have a plan for that town hall, or that eagle artillery. Wanting to take that down, I would guess, and sending... No! Hey, wall breaking into the near the scatter shot as the queens continue her way through. One more wall breaker to use, but remember, time's going to be an issue. Oh, here are the super minions with that grand warden coming in. Uh oh, that warden is like leading in front of these super minions. That's the issue. These super minions hit from so far away that the warden is like acting as like the thing pulling traps as it pops, as she pops the early, early warden ability. Out comes an inferno dragon. Taking out the enemy queen. King into the defensive eagle. As her queen is continuing into the scatter shot. Having to have to remove the CC. And the battle drill. By itself down to the bottom side. That king did clear the top side with the royal champion up there. Super minions are going through the core here. Does have them reaching through. But the battle drill does open. Didn't get the value she wanted. 
as now, unfortunately, the Monolith is going to be hitting that king. He is dead with the Electro Titan still there. The Monolith is going to not go down. The Warden stops hitting it. The Hound pops. Definitely probably wanted to get more value with that battle drill. RC goes down. Queen will secure the monolith hit here with a few shots. Does have the invis. Never ended up using the invisibility spell. As she's continuing to move around. But she's going to get more percentage. But I'm really curious of if the sweeper was actually pointing to the right side there. Nice try. The RC is going to go down. Does have queen ability. Is this... Pretty much going to be a time fail with Queen ability and an Invis. I think so. The Queen probably would be able to stay alive to get the rest of this base here with those healers to protect her. Man, nice effort there. What a great try. Not going to get it. And it's going to be the 87% two star, but it is going to give them the lead. GG. Tempers got the Barbarians, Archers, Clone. Is it going to be the Super Archer clone here? With a handful of balloons and rocket loons in the mix. Couple giants. Let's see. What is the plan here as the balloons are down with that warden? Yes, and a few rocket loons to go into the Archer Tower. Early, early warden ability. Really protect as much as possible. Out comes Super Minions from the defensive CC. The Sweeper does push back once. That's going to be okay. Uh-oh. There's the invis. Okay. There's the clone. Super minions. Another invis. So the super minions are trying to clear the court, but they're... Uh-oh. They're going to get pulled. No, he does kill the CC, but are they going to go for the town hall? Are they going to go for the town hall? He's got three. He's got a handful more of invisibility spells. The warden might just... Yes, the warden sneaks into the invis, but... He does not get the town hall there. I'm not sure if that was... Did he plan to get the town hall? I would assume so. The town hall does stay. Because if we're looking at what he has left here... Not too many spells. He didn't use those last invis. So he can use it for his queen. That's a lot of damage on his queen. But going... Oh, look at the warden. He's still going. The warden is still going. Gonna remove the ground expo. That's actually huge. That's going to help for potentially this queen charge. Oh my, how is that warden still alive? Is that like impossible? Don't tell me the warden goes for the... Oh, he activates the town hall. Okay. I was going to say, if he went for that multi dark inferno, he wouldn't have been able to take it down, but he does actually activate the town hall here. As the queen is going to continue into the enemy queen. Watch out. Ability mages have to be forced. No, uses the poison instead to slow her down. Going to have to freeze her. What's the plan here? Freeze. Oh, no, Invis! Whew, just in time to be able to remove this multi-target Inferno. Now going for the enemy queen. Okay, we got the RC over to the far left side. The town hall's still standing, guys. Uh-oh. The RC's making her way through. There's the Ice Golem Barbarians and Archers coming to the bottom side near this town hall. But that Invis is waiting. It will activate. The king is running down to the bottom side. Still has a couple freezes. He's... Pushing everything to... The Don't tell me this is like a 99% one star. If that happens... Dude, look at this. He's still moving. There's the freeze on the invisibility. So he can help take out the monolith. The invis goes up, but they're going to ignore the town hall. The queen still got ability. Look at this attack. He still has a freeze. Still has an invis running around 30 seconds. But look at how many troops he still has. Up. Oh, my brilliant with 24 seconds the queen where is she going she's oh it's a race i think it's fine they pops ability to go for the wall we have rocket loons going into that town hall and he's making his way straight there pulling some traps but it is gonna be the three star with the very last building being the town hall going down very nice attack there to temper wow style is in with some rocket loons Four golems. He's got some skeletons. Some recall. Not some recalls. Just one recall. It's going to be the Skelly Donut to remove the clan castle. The eagle artillery. And then are you going to do another donut? Okay, no. Using the next invis to be sure. No, that, that eagle doesn't want to go down. Okay. Oh, a bunch of skellies come back. They go straight to the king, but that's not going to do much there. 
Okay, still has three more skeleton spells to utilize. No more invis. Eagle and Clan Castle are down as he sends a wall wrecker behind a golem to try to make its way into that monolith with a queen. No healers. 14 rocket loons here for style. As another skeleton to try to distract the monolith as the wall wrecker is going in behind the golems here. The headhunter is going to help take out this king. Oh, look at the skeletons doing work. The king getting slowed down, looking really good. And that wall wrecker is still not targeted. Somehow is just moving through, taking that down. Now, finally, the monolith actually goes down. Recalls the queen. Okay. Sends a skeleton with a queen recall with no healers to the left side. Rakalut's coming out of the wall wrecker, taking out some bomb towers, ta taking out the monolith. Now really trying to get this queen to go into the town hall here. Now the warden with the king to try to move his way towards that scatter shot. But there's a lot of damage. Double skeletons popping. That Tesla farm. Ground expos over there. Headhunters. Oh, that poison lizard with that warden is actually huge. Slowing down the enemy queen as he's continuing his way in. Pops the ability with moving through. That royal champion can jump the... Where is she? Wait. No. She goes to the ground expo. Freezing. As he's trying to... No, the enemy RC is over the wall. So the king's going to get stuck. Town Hall is going to explode. But what is the plan to try to get these infernos in the core? He definitely wanted that RC to go into the core there. As her ability goes off, she's sitting in the poison. But nothing's going for the middle. He needed that RC to go through into the core. As he still has a... Def There's a defensive rage still standing in the middle. Oh, man. Nice effort there. With some rocket loons trying to come around. Three more to use. Rocket loons to the top side. Into that air defense. Into the mortar. Very nice try to style here. But wolf shears and temper are going to have that star lead right now. There's still plenty of attacks to come in. With the judge voting at the end to assign any potential bonus stars. And this is going to be a nice percentage here in the mid 80s. Grabbing a little bit more. 86. Maybe an 87 with this minion. Gonna do it. 10 seconds. The race against the clock. Come on, minion. You got it. The one and the only minion getting the 87% there. And now it will... Oh, that's it. Out of time. But nice try to style. Getting the 87%. Good luck with the Valkyries. All right. He tried it before. A little bit short. But he's now believing in this one. The Valks again. Into... He's got that Stone Slammer to utilize. Taking all it. Okay. Sending it straight into the Bomb Tower. So it can do damage and then hopefully go down. Oh, he gets a shot off. And then it'll explode. And then the Super Wizard should stay alive. There's the Invis. Rage. Okay, yeah. Super wizards are alive. Giant bomb is there. Oh, no! <gasps> the giant bomb! Are you serious? Oh! Oh! Rip to the super wizards! Oh, no. Poison spell off to the right. Gonna charge this queen in towards that scatter shot. Dealing with the super minions here. But this is huge. This is huge for Style and Rocio to try to hold the defense and get allow them to make a comeback with a triple to tie it up here as the Warden is with this Queen. But the Town Hall is staying up is going to be a huge problem as being patient with these Valks. They may get pulled over to that multi mortar, sending the King now to try to get into that single in the Town Hall. Rages up the Queen. All right. Where's the nine Valks? Pops the ability to protect that queen. As he's continuing his way through the town. Oh, that king. He, oh, just in time. Freezing the single by the town hall. So the king can help remove that. But the royal champion is moving down to the bottom side. Queen's going to try to take this jump towards the model of king's ability. Secures the town hall. Making the queen invisible. Oh, through the eagle shots. Forces her ability. But no more spells here. No more rages, I should say. Taking out the enemy, enemy queen. The RC's doing some work. He's got a couple spells here. Magic. Wait a sec. Hang on. This Tassel Farms, though, is going to be a big problem. This queen needs to be able to secure... Oh, that Invis is clutch. That Invis is huge. Where is this? I can't even see where his RC is. Okay, she's moving down south. Wait a second. 
This actually still might work. He's clearing that defensive rage. The Royal Champ's moving down to the bottom side. The RC's got our ability. 40 seconds. Queen's on a wall. The Valk's gonna help clear that Skelly there. Oh, that Diggy is doing work. And at the pop RC, skips through, takes out the Arch Tower, takes that out. Time, time, time is gonna be the problem. Queen is on the wall. The Valk's running around, freezes the scatter. A skeleton spell, a skeleton trap pops here. But there's no way. There's not enough time to run around with 14 seconds left. Oh, man. Oh, it's close. It's going to be a time fail. And with what happened, it's going to be a time fail. What a recovery there into the 90s. Great effort with the Valkyries. Wolf Shears, nice try. Nine. In her attack here with 30 sneakies. 30 sneaky goblins. A couple lightning has the invis. All right. With a dragon rider trying to go into the eagle. Will she be able to get that value? But look at all the storages near the town hall. 30 sneakies is the investment of choice. Was that two lightning to try to take out? What, what, what was she trying to go out? Take out. Uh, I don't think she, I think she tried to get the sweeper, but it didn't go down. Um, did grab the queen platform there, but the eagle artillery is going down. There is an ice hound. Oh, okay, gonna, okay, that's what the lightning was supposed to be. So, Fro ended up freezing the sweeper. We're gonna try to clear this section. Another invis. Oh, just in time there. Very nice. Gonna help try to take out the multi. Gonna go for the scatter. Gonna go for the other multi-target inferno. Scatter shot. There it is. Scatters down. Soup. Oh, we, she does kill the queen. Gonna completely clear the section, sending the, her queen over to the far right side. With 20 more sneakies. Oh my, that's a lot of sneaky goblins. Didn't clear a lot of the space so far. But if these sneakies do not secure that town hall, it's going to be a one star. Because that is going to be insanely difficult to recover from. As the golem is going to try to tank for this queen as she's running around. King is down as well. More sneakies are coming through. 20 more left. The queen's walking through, but the hound does get lured. Gonna go to this queen, gonna have to force ability or something. Ability goes off, not taking out the scatter shot. That's gonna be a problem. As the king is not gonna go into the section. Nope, yep. Runs around, pops ability, goes to the air defense. The Tassels is gonna be quite annoying. Still has Warden. Descending potentially with an RC. There's the Sneakies under a haste. To try to go for the town hall. Oh, oh, Sneakies, do secure that. Another, oh, they're not even going for the, wait, what? How are they not going for the town hall? How are they going over there? No. Wait a second. Guys, they're... why are they not going for the town hall? What is going on? What is this AI of the sneakies? Are you serious? Finally, now they're going for the town hall. Huh? Then there's a tornado trap too. The hound pops. Uh-oh. Um. There's the sneakies. All oh, oh, please don't be a bunch of traps. There's the invis. Okay. Town hall. Town hall. Come on. Come on. Come on. Town hall. Come on. Town hall. No, 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 no. <gasps> okay. RC can secure it. Oh, no. <laughs> the town hall. Wait. RC ability. There's the Valkyrie, but that won't do anything. There's the freeze. Um, Pops Warden. Oh, no. Wizard goes down. Come on. Ability. Go to the town hall. Ability. Skips. Yes, the town hall goes down. <laughs> Look at Style. He's like, thank you. Oh, thank you. Oof. He, she secured the two star. Keeps us in it. <laughs> oh, oh my. Very nice try. Rip to the sneakies. Oh. And he's saying, you know what? I can bring the 30 sneakies. I can bring the 30 sneaky goblins and try to get it done here with. Look at all these spells. Quite a bit of, with the recall. Tunnels to the bottom side. Are we going to see a queen charge? Or a warden walk? Most likely a queen charge. Yep. The queen charge to the bottom side. Near six, near that town hall. Probably going to use this queen to remove these storages. And then recall the queen for the sneaky goblins to go for the town hall. So that the sneaky goblins doesn't have to like waste or use any. That would be maybe a smart move there. Kind of nice. Nice. There we go. Now you, now you can recall. No, let the queen get the bomb tower. Well, all right. Never mind. Recall that queen. 
Sending the queen to the top side. Now the sneaky should have nowhere to go but the town hall. So that was a really nice use of the queen there. But the question is, would that be the value for a three star? As I don't even know. Oh, he dropped some sneakies to go into the town hall, which does lure out a little bit of this clan castle. And more goblins are coming out of the CC. We have to like pay attention to both things happening as the queen is charging into the scatter shot. Not setting anything for the town hall just yet. Okay, there it is. There's the sneakies for the town hall and the queen charging into the scatter. There's the invis. Sneakies are going to secure the town hall. Maybe? Yes. Just barely. As that's happening, we got a flame flinger to the far left side. Rocket loons going off to that queen. Still has a poison spell. Not using it yet, but that queen. Oh no, her ability was forced there. As the king of warden coming off to the right side to move into that eagle artillery. Sneakies are being used everywhere. Look at this. Still has 16 sneakies around this base. Like, used a handful for the town hall, but still using the sneakies to help potentially set funnels and take buildings down. As we've still got an ice golem to utilize. King's got ability. The queen is still charging. There's... Oh, look at the wall break. Brilliant wall break to open up that wall for that queen to continue her way in. There's a jump into the core. Super minions do come out of here, and he still has the poison. Pops the RC ability. You can poison those super minions. The defensive invis goes off. That jump spell gives access for the queen to jump through the core, but also gives access for these barbarians and keen to continue his jump. Look at this. Look at this. He's still charging through, but the problem is he didn't take out the multi to the far right by the enemy queen. There are the super minions. And there's the poison spell making the queen and healers invisible with yetis coming out of the flame flinger. It's not looking too bad here. The biggest threat is going to be this tassel farm over here. Freezing the multi and the... Oh, wait a second. 30 seconds. It's a race against time. Temper. Look at what he's doing. Oh, my. This man putting up another one. A three star. Coming through with that freeze to the bottom side. And GG. Temper putting on a show. Very nice hit there. Getting another good luck with the skeletons and bats. And it's going to be the skelly donut to remove the CC, remove the monolith, not taking out the multi because he probably couldn't grab all three at once. There we go. CC's down. Monolith. Oh, oh, yes. Monolith is down as well. So that skelly donut able to get that value. With those balloons into the arch tower and one rocket loon, a couple more into the wizard tower. As he's gonna move his way through, and the blimp is going to look to help remove this town hall. As we got a bath over by the eagle now, at the same time, he's moving through the space, one picking off each one of these compartments. So he wants these balloons to just move and grab that eagle as the dragon rider is coming in. Now we have a king going to the scatter, but style has allowed this dragon rider to make it to the eagle so that's going to be a clutch dragon rider as the town hall was secured with that blimp sneaky goblins queen's following behind moving into the tassel farm scatter shot eagle is now gone pops the king ability taking out the enemy royal champion as he's continuing this push through still has the grand warden but notice the warden does have the poison lizard so if you put the warden on air then nope never mind the warden's on ground because then you would have the ground poison lizard moving with an air warden, potentially. That's not the case. And look at this. Sneaking one dragon rider to go into this this section. Oh, no. Oh, but it stays alive. Okay. The dragon rider can move and get some fantastic value through there. With 10 more Rackaloons. Makes the queen invisible. The defensive rage is not nice. Pops the warden ability, which protects the queen. Protects the RC. Pulling the poison spell. Removing that defensive king, but the rage freeze trying to keep this RC alive trying to get that value the RC under rage trying to get some damage off No, not a oh wait Something killed the queen. It might have been the poison lizard from that warden But the problem is this section is still up and there's nothing to protect these balloons. No more spells as they go down Very nice try to style there man the the planning, the efforts of a lot of these hits. I love them. Fantastic. Unfortunately, coming short there. GG. Getting it done. Minions. Trying to get a little bit more percentage. Minions to the top side. And there we go.
It is going to be about an 81%. Not going to get much more. 24 seconds. But uh, Temper and Wolf Shears will have a two-star lead, which is most likely to be safe. But of course, we'll always go to the judging to see the only time when it's not safe is if there's a three-star lead. Then there's no way for judging to make a difference. But GG to Style. 82, 83, 84. Nope. It is just going to be the 83% two-star. Great effort there, which means the final score in the game we have is going to be 10 to 8, and the percentage is a 74, point, 74 flat to a 64.2 overall. But, of course, let's go and check out the judging. All right. The judges will uh, get the judging in. And now, what that means is we... Dun-dun-dun. Let me go and end that. Boom. All right. And let's go over here. All right. So, while the judge gets their votes in, um, war is ended. There we go. Because Wolf Shears and Temper also have the lead. We will go ahead and open... You guys know what, right? 